A driver survives a crash off the road and winds up trapped in the wreckage overnight. Tonight, we're hearing from the firefighter who helped rescue her. WBZ's Louisa Moeller is live in Epping, New Hampshire tonight. And Louisa, a number of drivers passed right by that crash scene. Well, Lisa, it was dark, and firefighters say she was just far enough off the road and down embankment to be out of sight until morning. This is how Janice Cathcart's Volkswagen lay for about 10 hours, tucked behind a row of trees 75 feet from the road, the 70-year-old inside and trapped. The wheel caught the, um, the soft shoulder, pulled the vehicle in. Um, that's a, about a 40, 45 mile per hour area dragged her into the woods. The Epping, New Hampshire Fire Department says it happened around 10 last night. Cathcart's car left Route 27 and rolled over into these woods. When she landed, she landed on the side of the vehicle, uh, driver's side. When it came to a stop, she managed to unlock her seatbelt, but the car was on its side and out of sight of nearby drivers. Her cell phone nowhere to be found. She crawled into the back seat and covered herself with clothes and a blanket. She's pretty resourceful. She had worn her safety belt, which, which really helped her. Crawled into the back seat where she had a bunch of clothes and put those clothes on to keep her warm. Finally, around 6.30 in the morning, she was found cold but conscious, brought to the hospital in stable condition. And right now, Cathcart is being kept overnight at the hospital. We're live in Epping, New Hampshire. Louisa Moeller, WBZ News.